Hi, I'm Miss Jennifer, and today I want to talk to you a little bit about the category think. What would happen if? And um, the idea of this is that you're going to come up with ideas that might happen and ask your child, what would happen if? And these can be silly things or they can be real things. Um, for example, you're driving to the store and you know, if your kid's anything like my kid, they know the way to the store. And so maybe, you know, when you get to the stoplight, you could say, what would happen if we went this way instead of that way? And, you know, just think about, like, let them think about where would we end up? Where would we go? Why would we go there? Um, another idea could be, you know, you see your child just playing with their toys. Hmm, what would happen if that dinosaur was alive? You know, what would happen if, you know, Superman was real? Or, um, what would happen if Spider-Man could talk? You know, just stuff like that. And let them really just, like, think about what would happen then. And also, why? You know, that's really important, too. Why do you think that that would happen? Um... Some other ideas, maybe you're going for a walk or playing in your yard, you know, hmm, what would happen if ants were really big? Or what would happen if grass was blue and the sky was green? What would happen if we never cut the grass? And why? Why would that happen? Um, and during all of these talks, just encourage your child to promote those predictions. Because sometimes when you ask a kid what would happen if they don't they, they don't know how to answer that so you know encourage their predictions by guiding them um, for example you know with the ant question you know well if he was really big what would he eat and is he friendly is he mean where does he live you know and really get them to just think about um, what is happening in the world around them and really to dig into those big ideas that they're going to be exploring. Um, you know, what made him big? How did he get big? Is he going to stay big or are we going to make him small again? And how would we do that? And those are just some ideas for how to play that game with your child. And um, thank you for watching and enjoy the next segment.